Sam here from Technologetic and chances are if you're watching this video you do not know the difference between extended and clone displays. So in this video I'm going to be going through the differences between them and why you should use one over the other. At the moment I currently have my monitors running in extended mode. This simply means that both monitors are displaying different content. This also means that I can move my mouse between the monitors. This also means that I can drag windows between the monitors. Clearly this works better when both monitors are exactly the same. An advantage of having your monitors in extended view is you can take advantage of what's called presenter view. In the slideshow settings of PowerPoint, you can select Use Presenter View and show the presentation on your other monitor. If you're using a laptop and a projector, the show presentation on will be something like projector. Here, all you have to do is start your slideshow and you have this interesting view here where you can see your upcoming slides, your notes and the actual slide as well as the running time and actual time as well as slides remaining. Whereas on the other monitor, which in theory would be your projector, will actually display the presentation. This allows you to see what is coming up, how long you've gone for, and actually annotate on, um, on the slide. The other possible mode here is cloned slash duplicate mode. By going into the screen resolution settings, you can duplicate the displays and you can now see the same thing is displayed on both monitors. This is useful for scenarios when you want to put a laptop onto a projector screen and you want to see what is on the projector without having to turn around. You can see here that I cannot drag uh, windows between the monitors. The disadvantage of having your monitors in cloned or duplicated mode is you can't use the Microsoft PowerPoint uh, presenter view. So now, if I start a PowerPoint, it's exactly the same thing on both monitors and on your, uh, hypothetically, on your laptop monitor, you would not actually be able to see what slides are coming up. One thing to note is if your laptop is, say, uh, on a lectern and then the projector is behind you, it may sometimes be confusing to configure the extended display. Often if you just drag a window left or right, it will appear on the next display if you're in extended mode. 